वेलकम टू साथ कैन एजुकेशन सर्विसेज असलम स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन दिस इज मी मिस सारा लियाकत टुडे इज आर ट्वेंटी सेकेंड लेक्चर ऑफ इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज फॉर क्लास फाइव सो लेट्स बिग हेन डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एंड सॉल्व चेक पॉइंट नंबर थ्री इट इज ऑन पेज नंबर एटी वन इन योर ग्रामर ट्री फाइव स्टूडेंट्स टे वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व एक्सरसाइज ए एंड सी एंड इट इज़ योर होम टास्क टू सॉल्व इट एज वेल एंड इन एक्सरसाइज ए वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एक्टिव पैसिव फर्स्ट एंड देन आई सॉल्व दैट पर्टिकुलर एक्सरसाइज एंड इन एक्सरसाइज सी वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस कंजंक्शंस अ सेंटेंस इन विच द सब्जेक्ट ऑफ द वर्ब इज द एजेंट ऑफ द एक्शन denoted by the verb is said to be in the active voice a sentence in which the subject does not perform the active denoted by the verb but is acted upon is said to be in the passive voice here you can see in the picture some major and proper difference between active and passive in active voice subject plus action word and then object but in the passive voice object comes first and ac- action word also changed into the third form of the verb and then subject goes in the last active what subject does uh, but in passive the focus is on the action as you can see in the example ram killed raman but its passive voice was raman was killed by ram so you can now easily able to understand what is difference between active and passive as you also studied in the previous lectures in class as well so students here you can see solved exercise a in exercise a all you need to do is to change the following sentences from active to passive voice and passive to active voice one has been done for you already tala asked the post office to deliver the package to his friend as soon as possible here you can see the subject tala and post office is the object other sentence is the same so you have to do it like that way now moving on to conjunctions what are conjunctions a word used to connect clauses or sentences or to coordinate words is in the same clause for example and but if that these all are the conjunctions a conjunction is a word or a group of words that can join other words group groups of words or sentences a conjunction therefore helps us to make what we want to say shorter and more important so students now it's exercise c time all you need to do in exercise c is to join the sentences below with the conjunctions given in the bracket the first one the second and the third fourth all are solved for you she was happy as long as her demands were being met as long as he woke up comma you can see that he had to go out neither amna nor salma knew the answer number 4 is no sooner had meher finished the meeting than she was called for another one okay all you need to do is to solve make the title page of checkpoint 3 first of all then you have to solve exercise a and c write down the summary that you are going to do exercise a and c in your copies i want neat and clean work students with the proper formation and also give space after every word okay students this is your home task that you have to make the title page of this checkpoint this is checkpoint 3 also write the summary below that name of the checkpoint that you have to do exercise a and c in your copies maintain your indexes as well mention the date on the top of your pages and then you have to solve exercise a then exercise c with the proper questions each and everything okay 
so this is the end of our today's lecture i hope that you are able to understand it much more betterly take good care of yourself take care allah hafiz